I'm going to walk you through some best practices when it comes to your try before you buy landing page. So here we have your store and you want your try before you buy button to be pretty accessible from your homepage. So as you can see, we have that right there. You want this to be a high level overview of your program as well as just to proactively address any questions your shoppers may have about try before you buy. So you want this to almost highlight a step by step of what try before you buy is. So here we have the classic choose try buy icons. If you want to use this exact visual, you are more than welcome to do so. It is available in your marketing toolkit. Um, so we have a very bird's eye level view over here of your program. And then we do also recommend having an FAQ section um, just to address questions such as how many items can I try at once? How long is the try period? How do I keep or send back my try before you buy items? Um, having a frequently asked question section also takes some of the weight off of your customer service tickets. And of course, uh, just with any landing page, you want to have a call to action at some point. Here we have the try before you buy button here. And when you click it, it takes you to the products page. And there you have it.